Every, oh, every time I drink water, it's like a product placement. <laughs> yes. This is, I hope it's a typo, Olivier? Is it a W? It's a typo. Good. Olivier. Cool. So I'm Oliver. I'm from Australia. I'm actually from Poland, so oh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Just a first name, because I don't want people to. Oh, that's fair. Okay. Yes, that'd be really bad. The thing is, if you search my name up, like, I'm the only person with the name, so. So, yeah, you're <laughs> Cool. <laughs> He's here all the way from the great land of Down Under Australia, and he is the winner of our toughest oh. gaming rig yet. Jesus. Something, something, descendants of criminals and all that good stuff. Let's get started. <laughs> Tough no, we gaming just, rig. So, oh, I see what you did there. So wait, so sorry, you got confused when I said blah, et cetera, et cetera, descended from criminals, like. Yeah, I, I'm not very good at references. So wait, sorry, you don't know that stereotype? Stereotype, what is it, for Australians or something? Yeah. I'm well, not Australian, I'm Polish. You are? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> well wait, what's this accent then? Uh, it's like a mix of it, like Polish and Australian. Okay, all right, okay, all right, okay. How I became a fan of LTT, I have no idea. It just kind of eased in, I guess. Um, I saw a few videos, you guys started doing really ridiculous crap that nobody else is doing, like 10 gamers, one CPU and whatnot. Uh, I decided to sign up for Floatplane. Uh, this is another one of those questions where I don't really know the reason why. It just kind of felt natural to do it. Like I already watched heaps of your videos and I just kind of thought, you know, it, it makes sense to support you guys. Like Netflix is a paid subscription. YouTube seems like a free thing and I just, why not support you guys through Float plane and get access to the videos much sooner as well. So it's a win-win either way. Well, let's build a computer, shall we? Cool. Have you ever done this before? Uh, kind of, but not with hardware like this. Mainly like pre-built computers that are easy to like put back together. You know what I mean? Okay, so when I ask if you've built a computer before and you say yes, but well, a pre-built. kind of, it depends. So I have taken apart pre-built computers in the past, but that's pre-built computers. Everything just kind of fits into place only a certain way. When it comes to building a computer straight up from like new parts, I have not done that before. So this is a completely new experience for me. Okay, let's say no, let's go with that. All right, so let's go ahead and lay out all the parts we've got. So we've got a tough heatsink, tough SSD, Tough motherboard. The theme of the build is tough. Tough, all okay, right, I see. Tough RAM. Yes. Oh, Jesus, that's tough. Tough mouse pad. <laughs> oh, tough my headset. Lord. Tough keyboard. Tough gaming monitor. Tough mouse. Look, it's not a question of how much stuff we have. This is more of a question of how much stuff you are taking home because all of that's this a lot of stuff. goes together. From what I've seen from the past few years, the machines were pretty beefy, and I think that's exactly what we're gonna end up getting. So I'm a full-time student. One day I aspire to do photography. Uh, it's probably gonna end up changing as it always does, but that's kind of the career path I wanna go in. So Olivier here has said that- <laughs> Just call me Oliver. <laughs> Oliver? Oh, Ollie. Keep it simple, Ollie. Ollie. You don't, you don't like Olivier? <laughs> no. Okay. So Ollie here says that aside from gaming, he's actually got another passion. So what do you want to do with this machine? Uh, I mainly want to put it for the use of, you know, editing photos and stuff like that, retouching. Um, and yeah, mainly creative work, so. Very cool. Okay, so conveniently, that monitor happens to use an IPS panel, so you will actually be able to use it for those things as well. But first, <laughs> you have to complete the rite of passage. You have to actually build the machine. Wish me luck. Yeah, I mean, where do you start? Well, let's go for the motherboard. Of course, that's where we start. That's a keyboard. Yeah, I know. I'm looking at oh, that. That's cool. Any thoughts of going in before meeting and building a computer with Linus? I don't know what to expect. I feel like there's going to be a lot of beef going on. Linus is going to be trying to make fun of me. We're going to be going back and forth. You know how it goes. Okay, great. Now, Ollie, I know you had said you wanted a minimalistic design. Um, we didn't manage to pull that off. <laughs> it's all good. All right, we got a ninth gen i7. I have no idea how many cores or whatever this thing has. 9700K. So 9700 Eight cores, eight threads, super fast. It's gonna rip through pretty much everything. Oof. Games, photo editing, video editing, you name it. Damn. As long as you don't break it in the next couple of minutes. There we go. All right, Ooh. you got this. So have you ever installed a CPU before? No, okay, <laughs> cool, that changes today. What could possibly go wrong? I mean, you have insurance, right? For this? No. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, of course not. No, if you break your computer, it's broken. Okay. I, I think he thinks I'm joking. <laughs> no, I'm, you're not. Yeah, Go no, on. if you break it, it's, it's broken. On. Don't worry though, it's tough. 
So we're going to line up our arrow with our dot. No force whatsoever. Obi-Wan need not be summoned for this task. <laughs> what? CPU is now installed. All right, well that's done. Let's do the RAM. Nope. <laughs> All right, go for it. Okay. Oh, oh boy. Oh that boy. That was janky. Hey, there it is. What's next? I don't know. Let's go for RAM. Sure. The tough RAM. Go for it. Do you think you can handle this on your own? You seem, honestly, you seem pretty confident. You're yeah. saying you're nervous. Yeah. Come on, click in. That was so unsatisfying. <laughs> Well, it's 32 gigs of RAM. Does that help with the satisfaction? <laughs> yeah, it's a it lot does. of RAM. It does, dude. One for every Chrome tab. I love it. My mom's so disappointed in me right now. <laughs> <laughs> can't even, can't even click the RAM in properly. It's like the easiest part. Nah, you're good. Yeah. You got it. All right, 32 <laughs> gigs of RGB RAM, just like that. What's so, next? Uh, I don't know. What do we put the cooler on now or something? Or you can do it in whatever order you want. That's the way that it is. So power supply it is. And I'm just here to facilitate. We could do the power supply now if you want. Sure. Don't be the dumbest idea. I could come up with something dumber if you'd like. All right. Another one of these boxes that you don't know how on earth to open. Thank you. Here's our weird knife. Sorry that our Canadian knives are too weird for you. Yeah, it's all good. They're sharper than what we have. No, I thought that Australia I mean, is like have... the land of, no, that's a knife, you know? I'm gonna use this to pry the box open because uh, my fingers are not that small. <laughs> so now we just follow the order of operations. So back plate goes on the back. All right, do we build on top of this thing or do we like? Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, cool. Well, I'm asking you what the right way to do it is. You put the motherboard on top of that. You put the motherboard on top of that. Are you crazy? <laughs> you just dump the motherboard, that's a dump, no. There's no way you do that. Oh, that's the bottom part. You put the motherboard oh, I get it. on top of that. <laughs> you can give it a bit more than that. A bit more? Yeah, a bit more. That's good, that's good, that's good. Oh, oh, oh wow. Oh. Okay, you gotta kind of wipe it. Um, uh. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Oh God. Oh, okay. You have to have Minus. it centered. Is it centered? I mean, it should be. Look. Okay, just, 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 just stop, stop, stop fussing with it for a second. It's fine. Are you gonna tighten it down? Yeah, you're looking at me like I'm doing something wrong. I probably no, am. No, you're just slow, that's all. Not the best at screwing. Don't take that the wrong way. There's only one way to take that. That's what she said. Oh boy. <laughs> Is that tight enough for you? Yeah. All right. Until it falls off. That's what she said. Okay. All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna install these handy dandy little fan mounts. So basically, you put these on both sides and then these guys stick in there. See that? Uh, do they just sit like this or do they have to push them through all the way? That's no, like you need to through. pull them through all the way. Okay. It's easier to pull from the back than to push from the front. Look, you can tell he's judging me. Look at it. <laughs> Look away the other way, I'm doing stuff, thank you. See, I feel so much more confident now. He's gonna like this better until he breaks something. That's a bit janky. Is it meant to be like that? Mm, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, okay. That's the Linus's motto. Yeah. It's, I mean, right. it's your computer, what do I care? All right, what's next then? Cool, I guess we like throw it in the case now or something. We could do that, sure, would you like to do that? Yeah, let's go for it. Okay. You're sure there's nothing else to mount to the motherboard before we put it in the case? Well, now that you're saying it, I feel like there is, but I'm just gonna... Well, if we're gonna put the graphics card in, we'll do it like once we get the motherboard in, right? Anything else though? Oh, for God's sake, what are we missing? I, I'm, I'm not saying we're missing anything, I'm just asking if you're sure that there's nothing else. He's zooming in on something, I can tell we're missing something. Maybe we should let your mom do it. Yeah. Well, he, he zoomed it in like... <laughs> can you stop handling that like that? Okay, Why do you I, handle it? Do you do the you side? clearly learned how to build computers from my show. Okay, yeah, that, this well, is, that's this, why I don't know how to do it properly. This is a machine that actually needs to work for an extended period of time after. Like you want to actually use this for years to come, right? Yeah, of course. So I we're do. gonna handle it by the edges. All right, all right, all right, cool. Stop it! That, like you said handle by the edges. The hardware first. Okay, Jesus. Have some lunch. You'll make you a bit happier. <laughs> Out of ten, how does it taste? With oh, I should put Vegemite in it. Mm -mm. We could. It's in my bag, Linus. <laughs> mm -mm. You're disappointing like hundreds of thousands of Australians right now. As far as I can tell, Australians know that Vegemite is terrible. They've just made it part of their culture so that they can meme it up and force other people to feel oh, yeah. bad for not eating it. 
No, I'm, I'm not it's a, eating it. It's a this. decent, yes you are. I've tried it. I'm not eating it. It's well, you can terrible. eat it again. It's terrible. Look at me, look at me, I'm trembling. Jesus. Excuse me. Oh, Tim Tams. Come on, some Tim Tams. What are Tim Tams? You never had Tim Tams? Okay, Tim Tams I've never tried. See, these, now these that's look where edible. the real disappointment comes in. All right, I'll try a Tim Tam. Oh, thank you. These look good. You said only half, take the rest. No, I mean, that's, uh, there's two in pack. No, no, no. These are good. Oh, this is half. Okay, cool. Ah, <gasps> uh, exactly. <laughs> Uh, it helps if you go in at a bit of an angle. I like that. Yeah, like that, yeah. Yep, you got it. Great. Okay, what do you want to put in here next? Uh, yeah, we could do your SSD now. Sure. Oh, all right. See, I never deal with this high-end stuff. There oh, you go. Jesus, that was eventually going to happen. That's fine, that's your computer. Thank you, that's all good. <laughs> I mean, it's tough, right? It's tough. <laughs> it's tough. Tough. I hate it so much when people look over my shoulder. <laughs> Graphics card. No. Oh, I want graphics card. Yeah, everyone wants to do graphics card. Graphics card comes last. Mm. Okay, well, power supply it is. All right, uh, power supply, let's do it. Hey, at least it's a cool power supply. It is a cool power supply. It, it has a wattage readout on the side. A what? A wattage readout. A wattage readout. Yeah, it says how much power your system's watts? drawing. 850 watts. Right on the side. Holy crap. It's 80 plus platinum. My That's current a... one is like 350. Ooh, my computer, that thing, it's, it's old. It's really old. Uh, when I first got it, it was actually a really decent computer. And even though it is still okay, it's on its way to dying, basically. Like, it's been around for six years or something at the moment, on its way to seven. So, yeah, I'm definitely in for a reboot. So this is really great. Ollie just found out for the first time that we don't ship the system to him assembled because he lives, lives in the land of Oz. So we actually are going to take the system back apart pack it all up in the boxes, he has to put it back together again. What's your confidence level? Uh, Building it without my assistance. Well, I can just watch a uh, Anthony build guide. Open up your power supply. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony build guide was a perfectly acceptable answer. Now, if he'd said anything about like Bitwit or Paul's hardware or anything like Ooh. that. All right, there it is. That is, is the kind of power. power supply that justifies, you know, this box, you know? So before you do that, I have a bit of a challenge for you. How do you get this power supply in that case? I want to uh, see if you can do it. I think we're going to have to remove this part here. All right, let's have a look. He got that a lot faster than I expected. Oh, I'm tightening it. How do you reverse this thing? Like that? All right, so this goes in the bottom of the case now. Cool. Are you familiar with the, uh, the comic strip Peanuts? No. Charlie Brown? Okay, well there's a character, Lucy, and she always promises Charlie Brown that this time when she holds the football, and I mean an American football, not a soccer ball, when she holds the football, she won't pull it away when he goes to kick it, causing him to fall on his back. And what's the moral of the story? <laughs> Dang it. I knew I was waiting for it to happen. All right, let's get this thing in there. I've got this one over here too. Can you grab this one for a sec? Yeah. What? I... Hello? You gotta grab the 8 pin too. Mm. Ah, you plugged it in already! Now for our last trick, we just need to cover up all that cable mess. Cool. So we'll put our shroud back, and, uh, well, I had this lined up a second ago. Shoot, I thought I had it figured out. Is it in there? It's not in there. There we go. Okay, it's in. Cool. Go ahead and screw it in. Thank you, that took you long enough. <laughs> He's gonna make me put it back in myself. Go ahead, <laughs> show me how it's done. Well, it's like, I'm confused about how it how it's even meant to go in there in the first place. Would you like me to fix it for you? Pardon? Uh, I mean, we're here, we might as well. This time without any sass. Oh, okay. You may help. You can put the other screw Oh, thank in. you. It's the most I can do. Well, I guess I can't use a special screwdriver. You can use a special one if you want. It's pre-warmed. See, that's ass heat Ooh. right there. <laughs> <laughs> 
Jesus, your ass needs some water cooling, man. <laughs> All right. So what would you like to install next? Graphics no. Mm -hmm. oh, it's such a slow burn. Why are you gotta be so boring, Linus? Oh, good, look at that there, magnetic, baby. Oh, hello. So no pressure, but however you hook these up, we're gonna be judging you. Ah, uh, it's all good. Are you gonna give me yeah, that yeah, cable yeah. or what? There you go, keep pushing. Uh, that's it, why is it going all the way through? I think from the entire build, the hardest part about building the computer was putting together the things that aren't usually shown in videos, like the tiny little, like, uh, I don't know, not fan headers, but for example, the RGB components and stuff like that, that usually isn't covered in a lot of the build logs and stuff like that. This is weird packaging. I've never seen this before. It's like, like strapped down with plastic. Cute. You wanna peel that, baby? Yes, I do. We're gonna ruin this peel. That is one hell of a peel. Thick, thick graphics card there. So Ooh. this is an RTX 2070 Super, which happens to be great for pretty much whatever you want. Oh. <laughs> No thanks. All right, line it properly. Yeah. It's a bit janky. Looking pretty good so far. Oh, I'm gonna, there we go. Oh my oh God, boy. there we go. Oh, okay. Got it. <laughs> nice. Did it click? Yeah, it I clicked. Like, didn't hear it. Looks pretty clicked to me. Okay, well, have a look. it's clicked enough. Oh yeah, that's clicked. You got this. So it's moment of truth time. Do you want to know if this thing powers up? I should, that'd be nice, I mean. It'd be nice going home knowing that everything actually works properly. That's All right, important. well, let's do it. Let's get the peripherals laid oh. out here. Come on, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Still minimalistic? <laughs> I mean, it could be more. We're hoping for the best. Hey! hey! Woo, there it is. How do you even know if that thing's on? It's so quiet. It's tough, you know? Yeah, but I thought tough was like loud. Um, tough can be quiet. Yeah. yeah. How do I think the build went? I don't know. I mean, I think it could have went better if I wasn't under all the pressure of like shooting of Linus and having it, you know, knowing that a whole bunch of people are watching me. But it was a new experience. I've never handled this sort of equipment before. As I said, usually just pre-built computers that are really easy to put back together. Uh, this is, yeah, completely different experience for me. And it was a heap of fun. I think out of all the things I'm most excited about the monitor, because for like photography, it's basically like getting a new pair of eyes, so. So while we wait for drivers to install, I'm gonna let you in on something. You did really well when it came to the monitor because you're actually gonna be running at 165 hertz on your IPS display instead of 120 or 144. Yeah. So that is a definitely noticeable, I mean, try it. Move the mouse. Jesus, yeah, that's a big difference. Okay, so uh, this is the big reveal. It's not big. Um, it was going to be the most beautiful one that we had yet. <laughs> but our laser aired out and there's no recovering it. I love it, so you got the mountain? Yep, it was going yeah. to have all of like Vancouver down here. Yeah. Oh, so it's like the, it's, going it's, all the, the, way down. it's the top most disappointing part, <laughs> I love it. At least there's a story behind it, like it's got some personality, you know what I mean. Oh, I didn't even realize this. So this is one of the G-Sync compatible displays. So even though it doesn't have a G-Sync module in it, it enables it by default. So you should be having the G-Sync experience. All right. Oh, that feels weird. That is like fluid as. How's it look though? It looks amazing. The 165 hertz, it's 165, right? Yeah, oh yeah. It feels so much more different. Like it hurts to see what I was missing out on. I think when I get back, I might start off with the video games just because I can't remember the last time I've had like a really good gaming experience. I feel like being stuck with the computer I have now, I've fallen behind in time. So every time a new game comes comes out, I'm like, oh no, <laughs> it's getting worse and worse. So I think I'll go straight to games. I'll play a bit of games for a few days and I'll go back to what I usually do, which is photography. <laughs> what is this thing? How are you still alive? I don't know. What? <laughs> Jesus, I don't know. So honestly, I mean, that's all we really need to know. How does it feel? It feels good. I mean, better than I've ever experienced. You notice how, you know, when you're gaming and it's working real hard, the system really like ramps up and gets loud? No, no, it was more of a trick question. Yeah, no. No, yeah, that's right. I was expecting a little bit of but. No. Just want to say a big thank you to ASUS and LTT for sponsoring this whole video. Honestly, I don't think there's any experience in my life that I had like this. 
It's it's a really trippy thing to be sitting right here and actually shooting a video of all the guys. I didn't really think I'd ever get the opportunity to do this. Um, also, a big thank you to Jono, who's sitting right in front of me. He had to put up with all of the problems that we came across. And honestly, I'd list them all, but I don't think we have enough time. So thank you very much, man. <laughs> So that's it for ROG Rig Reboot 2019. We had a couple of small hiccups, but I think we covered for them reasonably well, right? Yeah. Yeah. Can't See, complain. exactly. That's what's up. So good Look, luck, I guys. Killed someone. Congratulations hey. to everyone who won this year, especially you. How you feeling? <laughs> really? Did you get a kill? Yeah, I got one. Not hey, bad. There's a tank. <laughs> oh, that's rough. Yeah. And I guess we'll end on that note.